If you like this content, please watch the full video. Hit like, leave a comment below, and subscribe. Thank you. It really sucks when you're not attractive because men completely ignore you, right? So you're a little unhappy because you're not getting any, any attention. But if you're mediocre looking, like I, I've been my entire life, you kind of get attention. And then they fake pretend to like you just to use you. Waste your time, use your body. What? So you're just wasting all of your time and you're deeply sad inside. And if you're lucky, you get angry and fight back and leave. Like I did. But if you're really pretty, you get chased after all the time. And sometimes in a scary way. But you get chased after, desired, promised, all the promises. But you live in delusional land thinking that it's true love when really you're just feeding this guy's ego fairy tale. Oh, sounds like somebody is jealous of all the other women that look better than she does. That's what it sounds like to me. A little hateration going on right here. Get in where you fit in. That's all it is. You may be staying at home building a, a home with children, all the while he's building his career. He's building his career for who? His family that's at home. To leave you for a younger person. What's worse? I'm almost, I almost feel like being ugly is like the best thing that could happen to a woman. What do you mean by that? Because then you're not wasting your time with a man and you're building yourself and you're building your intellect and your career and your talents. The only thing I've ever regretted in my life wasn't getting my education, wasn't the time when I was single because that was the time I grew the most actually. It was the time that I spent with a man. Really? All that regret from the time that you spent with the man because he probably replaced you because you probably were acting a fool because you probably were nagging and he might have went out there and found someone that was younger and better than you. See, a lot of you women, you get married and you get in these situations and then you just do whatever you want to do. You let yourself go. You don't care. You think, oh, he's going to stay with me. It doesn't matter. I can gain 500 pounds. I can do whatever. I don't have to do my hair. I can walk around wearing moo-moos all day. It doesn't matter because I'm with the man. But you want the man to stay exactly the same as he was or better when you met him. But when it comes to a lot of women like you, you think that you can just do whatever and the guy is just supposed to accept it. You, build, you will be replaced. Just like a woman will replace a man that's not doing what he's supposed to do for her. So there's no difference in that. And being jealous of all these women that are uh, more beautiful than you, more attractive than you, you sound like a little child. Every single day there's a new batch of 18-year-olds that look better than everybody else. It is what it is. That's life. You guys think you have forever to hold on to this beauty that you have at 18, but you don't. You only have a certain amount of time. And then you get old. And you hit the wall and you start getting all these wrinkles and all these bags. And then all of a sudden you want to complain about the women that are younger than you. Then you masqueraded around as some type of caring about those women. Oh, make sure that you look out for this because you probably will get replaced because you're attractive. And this is what happens to attractive women. You're just jealous. You're just envious. You probably wasted a whole bunch of time. Now you're making videos complaining about men and complaining about women. Really? Ladies, you have to be smart and look past the smoke screen. What she's saying is not out of concern for you. What she's saying is misery. And misery loves company. You have the power to achieve anything you want. Don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals. And remember, stay focused, stay strong, and stay positive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.